I am done and washed. I am just waiting. I think that's them pulling up. I was going to say I'm just waiting for Jean to come. We went to go and pick up my mother. I wonder is it them? Don't see the car. I don't think it's them. Um, he went to go and pick up my mother in Ravensmeet. And so I'm waiting for him. And I just got dressed. And I'm literally going to wear loungewear today. Like this is my outfit. Oh, I don't really want to see. Okay, I think it's fine. I don't know if you guys can see. Like literally, this is my outfit for the day. It's a loungewear set that I bought at Shein because we are not going out. And I am on my monthly. And so I'm not going to stall. I'm not going to still get like a proper outfit. I'm wearing loungewear today. So this, 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 this is going to be my outfit for the day. Excuse the mess at the back. We're still busy moving in. <laughs> That's what you going to be my excuse. But eventually when everything has its spot, then everything else will fall into place. So there is a cupboard where that is going to go eventually. Well, that must be built where that's going to go. For now, it's going to have to stand there. But anyway, so this is my outfit that I am going to be wearing and rocking today. What am I going to do with my hair? Either I'm going to look like this with my hair. Or do I tie it up like that? I think I'm going to tie it up. Like that, yeah. Let me tie it up rather. I'm not even gonna pull a comb through my hair because now, no, 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 no. I've got a headache. I'm coming down with flu. Like I can feel. I can't stop sneezing. And then like on the inside of my nose, here by my sinus areas, it's just dry. So, I actually bought like a, a booster shot, like smoothie type of thing at Woolworths. I'm going to drink that now. And that's what the hair is done. Like I'm literally just going to walk like this. This is, this is the hair. It's done. They don't even comb it. Mm. Oh, and then I need to put something on my lips and that is it oh this is something that I need to learn I need to learn that I need to put on sunscreen I keep <laughs> I keep on getting that I need to put on sunscreen especially because I'm using a retinol like last night I did a I did a skincare routine and normally like this comes with the retinol but if I do if I don't put the retinol on during the day um, if I put it on at night I don't put on the sunscreen but if I go out during the day if I did a retinol treatment the night before when I go out the following day I put on then the sunscreen because this is SPF 50 and these SPF 50 sunscreens are very expensive yeah, I think the people came right on time. And where's the doorbell? Must I bring my doorbell? It's a voice activated doorbell. Excuse me. Yes. And where's the people of the house? The people of the house is just pretty. Ooh, look at it. Yay, yeah, man. Yay, yeah, wait, wait. Look there first, man. Is it lunch, Yes. And yeah, what's that? Cool. Whoa. You're right. What? Cool. Where are you going? The we're not, indoors. We're not going out today. We're just going to be at home. This is, wow. This is a place to be like this. Cool. But you don't look too shabby. What is that, yo? No, this is my lounge. <gasps> <laughs> Even sure. my pajamas. <laughs> I'm sorry, a, I didn't get the memo. Is it a, a tracksuit? <laughs> I didn't get the memo. No, it's my lounge wear, so I wear this at home. It, only in the lounge. Yes. Must come, then you must come out of the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> now that is the Mother's Day plants. There's two. That's why it's twins. So one for 
Mami Skreton and one for Mami Kasongo. Okay, you so, have that cheese at the yeah, church you know? Yeah. So you'll just take a gift very, to very her. Very, very beautiful. So this is your Mother's uh, Day gift. This is so beautiful. This is what the budget allowed, unfortunately. No, but it's lovely. It shouldn't be expensive things. Yeah. It must be things you bought with your heart. Thank you, Wow. I hope you're a fan because I, I am. am. <laughs> I am. Thank you so much. Now, less than a month ago, I made it myself. You made it? How do you make it? That's a skill on its own, eh? But I got it right. Really? The jelly part and everything? Everything. Sure. Everything up to the flavor. That's ah. my greatest concern. See you watching me. When we're with our friends It's definitely something in the air So let's take it from there Cause I know you want it Afraid to let it show And I know you need it Why don't we let it grow, grow, grow I think it's time we stop tipping on our toes What's holding you back now, sugar? Cause I don't know what you know Mothers of Mother's Day and the soul. Mm. Oh, it's Sunday school. Let the book no the next day it's the day of the concert oh my back is so from coughing um, I'm still a little sick but we're just gonna have to push through this thing and I'm very excited oh, I'm very excited um, I'm gonna get dressed now it's about five o'clock I'm gonna get dressed and we are gonna leave here at six o'clock so we can get there at seven the concert starts at 8 and I've got my outfit ready let me show you guys so I just wasn't sure what to what to wear um, because it is raining you guys probably can't see oh, it is raining and it's not raining much but it is raining so I'm gonna have to make sure that I am warm and that my hair doesn't mince because I washed my hair yesterday. It's still in the same style that I had it yesterday where I put it into, um, you know, what do they call that? Dry curls or where I wrapped it around the, this thing of the gown, the gown's rope. Um, and so I'm hoping the curls are in, but I'm sure it's going to fall out. Don't care, but anyway, let me show you guys my outfit. Denim jacket my pants and then just a pants because I'm trying to wear what people wore in the 90s <laughs> I don't know um, and then this top I bought on Sheen so I don't know if you guys can remember back then in the 90s the basketball tops were in so I was thinking let me wear this but because it's cold and it's raining I'm just thinking of wearing maybe like a polar neck underneath it just to keep me warm and yeah so that's the outfit I'm gonna start getting ready now because I want to put some makeup on you know put some makeup on so I can look decent and yeah let me get that Ring outside. I don't know if you guys can see it is a pouring. <laughs> but anyway, guess what? I completely forgot to record um, for my YouTube channel. I was recording the whole process how I did my makeup and everything for TikTok, and I forgot. 
so I might add it in somewhere and remove the you know like the music or something but our trails will never run forever But this is the outfit. I'm gonna stand back. Okay, so this is the outfit I decided to go with. Like I said, I wanted to go with this top because it's got like you know the 90s theme to it. Just gonna put a cap on. Um, and then the curls came out beautifully. Came out very, very beautifully. Um, so yeah, the curls, and then I just put some hoops on because just to add to that 90s vibe. And then this is the outfit and then I'm just going to pair this with a denim jacket that I'm going to put on over and we are good to go. We need to go now. We're going to have load shedding within the next five minutes. Perfect timing. So by the time we get home tonight, um, load shedding is over. So I'm waiting for Jean at 6 o'clock. We're supposed to leave at 6 but once again he is late. So I'm going to have to wait for him to come home. I am done at least. And yeah. I was just put on my shoes, but this is the outfit. I'm gonna record on my phone when we get to the stadium. I'm busy charging it now, see how much charge I can get in. Um, because I'm gonna record as much as possible. So, see you guys there. Back streets, back, alright. Do, 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 alright. I can hurt you like you hurt me. Going there in the hopes that they're gonna see who I'm gonna put you out of the car if you say Westlife, okay? Because then oh, your ticket is you're not deserving of that ticket at all. Uh -uh. They give it to someone else, then kids are calling Backstreet Boys Westlife. Like, oh, uh, enough, the nerve, there's a big difference, anyway. Guys, we just got to Grand West and the traffic is crazy just to get in. It is crazy. I, will, I can't even imagine what are we gonna struggle to find parking now. Must park the sure, luckily it stopped raining, so nothing. We we'll find to walk if we had to park far from the entrance. Um, but we got here and we are excited! Yeah, 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 yeah. Back street boys, here we come. <laughs>
sorry about the noise. I'm busy boiling the kettle. Once again, we've got load shedding scheduled for 6 o'clock this evening. It was initially scheduled from 6 o'clock till 10 o'clock, but um, I see that they've changed the schedule. It is now from 6 o'clock till 8 o'clock, so I need to ensure that my kettle is boiled and everything is done. Um, but I just wanted to come in on here and close off this vlog because I didn't have time to vlog last night. The show last night was amazing, guys. I enjoyed the show so much. I got to see my future husband, Brian Literal. And oh, mm, look, yeah, man. So now they come on stage and everyone is there, and I'm like, who's that small one? Come to find out it's Brian. He's literally my size. <laughs> he was a little shorter than what I expected. He looks taller in the music videos. So, and small and very petite. I don't know. But we got to see the, the, the two personalities on stage. Um, for me, it seemed like Kevin, so the one with the long hair, who's got like the punk rocker type of style. Kevin, he seemed like the more reserved one and he's also the older one in the group. So I don't know if it's because he's the older one that he looked a little reserved, but um, he looked or came across as a bit reserved. Um, and then of course, Nick was the one who was the most outspoken and of course the youngest one in the group. Um, and Howie and AJ and yo, I enjoyed myself. I really, really, really enjoyed myself. I loved the performance. The only thing that I missed was a live band. So they didn't have a live band. They only had like the back tracks and they were singing to the back tracks. And they didn't have like any performances. But I loved the visuals. So they had like a screen behind them with the visuals on there. I like that. I like the, the smoke machines that they had. And they ended off the show with a bang as well. You know, when the artist walks off and say, guys, that's the end of the show. See you guys next time. And they say goodbye and they walk off. And the stage goes dark and the people are like, we want more, we want more. It's literally what happened last night. And people were like, we want more. And then they came back with like a final song. And that was the end of the show with the confetti at the end and the smoke machine and the smoke and things like that. But phew, I enjoyed it so much. Even up until the point that I even had a dream about Backstreet Boys last night. Like, mm. So now I feel like I want see more like they tapped into something yesterday with me going to the show and I, I, I can't say what it is tapped into a younger Ronald teenage Ronald and um, that awoke something in me where I'm like I, I need to see more now I've got that excited and uh, energetic and no um, stress type of feeling that you have when you are younger and you get excited for these boy bands and I got that excited last night so yes um, also I like the fact that they were very interactive with the audience um, so they would have these little um, sessions in between songs they would have these little sessions in between songs where they would need to do an outfit change and um, they did that but while they do the outfit change, then one of the band members would come on the stage to keep the audience entertained and say, um, Katang, how are you doing? Thank you for welcome, welcoming us to your country. Um, it's our first time here. And just, you know, while the others are getting dressed at the back. Um, so they had that. And then they also spoke a little bit about um, how old each band member was when they started the group 30 years ago. Do you know that Kevin is 52 because he was... No, 51, because he was 21 when he joined the group, and they've been together for 30 years. And then he was like, do not do the maths. <laughs> but he still looks good for 51. So we had, I had a ball of a time. I enjoyed the music. It took me back to my childhood years, you know. I really, really enjoyed it. I had a ball of a time. I will definitely, definitely go watch one of these shows again if they had to come to get down again for another show. And I... Hello! It is May the 29th today and it is my birthday and I am going to... Sean and I just got back. We went out. We had something to eat. We went for um, lunch at Bossa in Burgundy Estate and we just came back. Oh and then afterwards we went to Lumnos for some cake 
and we just got home, we're going to sit and relax, but before we do that, because we do have load shedding at 8 o'clock, so we literally have an hour to do that, to do what we need to do now. I'm going to do an unboxing of the gifts that John has bought me, he's bought me two gifts, so I'm going to do the unboxing right now. Okay, so sorry about the noise in the background, John is busy. Um, making some coffee for us. So this is the first gift that I bought. I was about to open it and then I realized, hey, I need to do this unboxing for YouTube as well. <laughs> so this is for kitchen organization. It's basically a storage rack. I'm gonna ask Sean to assemble it for me and hopefully if there's enough time, if not, I will just show you guys in maybe tomorrow's so video how, um, how I'm going to display it in my pantry. But this is a rack. John is going to send all this for me. And then there's a second gift which I'm very excited about. Stay tuned to that one. label my pantry items oh I'm looking forward to it so it's not just obviously not just for pantry but <sighs> let's unbox it so you think you were right bring it on bring it on prove me wrong go put up the fight the way I do way I do will knock you down you know there's a motion between us Don't, don't cry about it Don't, don't cry about it You want me to take you in my trust Oh, you know that ain't the way Oh, that is a so because we are going to have load shedding at 8 o'clock, there's not going to be time to actually use this machine today or to test it out. So we're going to run out of time. Also, I won't be able to... Um, I'm not going to do the pantry organization with the shelves. <laughs> I'm going to do that right now because again, we're running out of time and we want to sit and relax and enjoy the rest of the day and charge phones and things before 8 o'clock. So I'm going to continue the video when... On another day. Oh, not today. Anyway, I will check you guys in the next section of this vlog. 